What's up guys, today comparison video between the Proco Rat 2 and the Boss Turbo Distortion DS1. So there's a lot of bullshit that goes back and forth between the DS1 and the DS2 owners and uh, personally I think the DS2 is a lot more usable pedal, it's more versatile and uh, you know there's a reason why uh, people changed to it you know Prince used it uh, you know Cobain he he switched over after he smashed his DS1 uh, the Chili Peppers guy you know he he went to it the, the Cure uses it so there's a lot of people that use the DS2 it's I watched a lot of videos and a lot of videos you know I mean they're extremely loud like Literally, you can't tell the difference. All, all it sounds is, it sounds like shit to me. No offense to anybody, but you can't compare a pedal like that. And uh, that said, you know, I'm having a hard time. I'm sitting two feet away from my fucking cab, and the rat is just a real high noise floor that gives a squeal like a pig. So I have a volume pedal that I'm going to, you know, compensate for that, and hopefully it's going to come across on the video, because another thing I hate is DIs, you know, they they don't sound right to me, and it doesn't really give, I like a room mic, it, I get a better representation of what that pedal is, and uh, I have no other effects, in fact, uh, delay and reverb I'm turning off right now, and with that said, what I'm going to do is, I'm gonna, I have everything already set at noon on both pedals, we're on Turbo 1 for the Boss, and uh, we'll We'll do Smells Like Teen Spirit. We'll do two parts of it. Do the main riff and then that, -da -da, you know, two, two notes. And what I'll do is I'll edit it and put the rat and then I'll put the boss. And I don't have a looper and I'm, I don't intend to buy one. Not, not yet anyway. So, uh, it is what it is. I'll split it up, play it back to back and play it as close as I can get it. You can decide for yourself. Uh, right out of the gate though the Boss DS2 sounds a lot smoother it is, I, I did see a graph where uh, the one kid showed which was cool uh, the DS1 compared to the DS2 and you're expecting a lot more mid-range I'm not hearing that and uh, anyway if you have a lot more mid-range you should have an EQ on your board anyway to be you know shaping your tone it's an important tool that is often overlooked so there's the rat you rat bastard and there's the boss <laughs> 